on my hogs on 50 cal here to holler at y'all a little bit about this hood life from a positive outlook kick y'all a little knowledge nigga really fed up shit. hearing about all this bullshit that's going on in my own city in my own community you know what i'm saying it's like motherfuckers gotta wake up man this shit getting real old there's too many funerals there's too many young motherfuckers out here losing their lives to this shit you know what i'm saying it ain't older people who got their destiny in their own hands type shit these kids we talking about. We got babies, five-year-old little girls getting killed. Little girls getting shot up at parties type shit. Like the shit, I don't know, the shit really touch a nigga like, cause I got daughters of my own type shit. Not, let alone is it not you niggas that's putting your life on the line type shit, leaving y'all babies growing up by themselves. But y'all niggas got y'all baby mamas out here in the middle of this shit. We got females losing their lives type shit to this shit. I don't know, man. This shit getting out of control. The cops really don't give a fuck. And they eyes, y'all doing them a favor. You get to a motherfucking point where, where you gotta keep your banger on you. You know these niggas is out here looking for you. You know how the streets go, period. You don't want to get caught slipping, but at the same time, the cops ain't dumb and they know how everything is going. So you gotta worry about them at the same time. So, like, you get to the point where it's like, yeah, I'd rather get caught with it than get caught without it. It's a revolving door. You know what I'm saying? I've been there, coming up. Like you can ask anybody about me, you can check my background, nigga. My body full of holes type shit. It got to a point where it was like you gotta ride with your burner because these niggas is riding on you trying to catch you slipping. Or it's like the cops, they on you, you know what I'm saying? They waiting for you to catch you slipping with a pistol. It got to the point where I got shot. I got out on motherfucking, went to jail on a burglary charge. I got out on motherfucking probation. Violated probation because I got shot. They said it was gang activity even though I got shot in front of my own crib. Went back, served another eight and a half months. Like it got to the point where the same shit was happening over and over again. Straight up, man, I ain't here to preach to you, you know what I'm saying? I'm just letting you know what's real, you know what I'm saying? For somebody who done been through that shit and everybody who saw that shit. If you would've talked to me 10 years ago, I would've told you. It's nine blocks of my casket driving, you know what I'm saying? It's nine to the sun, you know what I'm saying? But as you get older, you get wiser. And that's a hundred type shit. Like, this shit, your, your big homies ain't gonna tell you this shit. But like, oh Jesus, locked up, ask them niggas, the niggas that's doing football numbers right now, 30, 40 years, ask them if they'll take that shit back if they could, type shit, like ask them niggas who coming to put money on their books every motherfucking week, making sure they family straight, like you ain't gonna see that shit, so, it's a message to you older niggas, man, be a positive role model in your motherfucking youngest life, you know, like, quit leading them niggas down the wrong path type shit, you done seen what the fuck this shit brings, you know what I'm saying, just like me, we done been through this shit, so it's like, nigga, it's up to us, you know what I'm saying? Like, these little niggas, we all positive role models in their eyes. If that's really what you want to call it, I feel funny even saying it in that form or that sense, you know what I'm saying? Because how the fuck is we role models if we showing them this is what's cool? Every time you see a young nigga die, it's all, rest in peace to my young nigga, all this, but you could have helped prevent this shit. You know what I'm saying? You ain't put no positive motherfucking influence in his motherfucking life. You didn't tell him to go to school. You ain't tell him to pick up them motherfucking books, you know what I'm saying? You ain't tell him about his future. Even a lot of the artists in our community type shit, a lot of niggas is getting they fame off of showing these young niggas, you know what I'm saying, to ride type shit. I be seeing videos all over Facebook and shit. You got young niggas talking about big gas and catching niggas slipping, popping niggas, all type shit. Like, what the fuck is you niggas serious, man? And they be y'all kids at the same time type shit. Like, I can never understand that shit. That's what you want for your shorty? You know what I'm saying? You putting this shit on your Facebook, everybody see what's on your shit. You dead. Five years, ten years down the later, your kids getting on your Facebook and they see what this what you want. And they want to be like daddy. You know what I'm saying? Or mama type shit. Like, females losing their life out here over some shit that they don't even got nothing to do with. They just trying to do what females do. Trying to go to parties, have good times, turn up. And they caught in the middle of all this gang violence type shit. Now they kids is without a mom growing up. Like, come on, man, put yourself in their shoes. Like, that's really what y'all want for our future generation type shit? I know that's not what I want for mine. So that's the only reason I'm even making these videos right now type shit. All these motherfucking homicides, but we got a conviction rate so goddamn low. None of these murders is getting solved. The cops don't give a fuck, man. They not even investigating this shit no more. 
And like, the shit is senseless, man. Like, understand how these niggas that they look up to and they claim to be they big homies or they OGs or whatever. Y'all look up to them, but they ain't got nothing positive going in y'all life. When I was a young to the block, the big homies wouldn't even let us be on the block until, you know what I'm saying, after school hours type shit, we'd get our ass beat type shit. That's just how we came up, but they not giving no positive in nobody's life. It's like these niggas nowadays is leading y'all straight to the goddamn penitentiary or to like, man, while you're still young, you got so many opportunities still in life, you know what I'm saying? So many things that you got going for yourself and so many things that you can make happen. Like, it's all about who you surround yourself with, man. Like, you can say that you ain't out here gang banging, but just being around the wrong person, y'all know how it is where we come from, man. Gang affiliation, that shit is real deep. So it's like, you need some positivity in your life. A job, you know what I'm saying? Stack this money, get prepared if for I your future. If I look at the positive and the negativity that then came out of it, I'd have met some of the coolest people I'll ever meet in my life. Some of the realest people you ever meet in your life who just, now they gone type shit. We ain't got nothing left but a memory. You know what I'm saying? Life, you only live once. You only get one life. Real shit. Once you gone, it ain't no coming back. Like, if the niggas y'all look up to and the niggas who done lost their life out here on this banging type shit, like, if you could ask them today, at this moment, if, would they take this shit back if they could? Now that they see how it played out and it's like, how long is your homies gonna ride for you, man? They gonna rep your name. They gonna put up pictures on Facebook and all that shit, but man, who gonna take care of your mamas? You know what I mean? Who gonna take care of your babies? Who gonna make sure the family's straight? Who gonna handle business like you gonna handle business like you can't depend on nobody once you gone? These niggas say they love you, they come to your funeral, and there's some motherfucking rap after that. But as far as the violence go, it's like, you ride on somebody, or somebody homeboy get killed tight. You know what I'm saying? People gonna ride for their homies, so it's like it's never really gonna stop because it's like you done did this us. You done did this to us type shit. Like, you know, that's just how it go, but you can separate yourself from the situation. Go to school, get an education, you know what I'm saying? Keep learning. You can never learn enough in this world, man. Anybody can shoot a motherfucking gun. Like, don't take a rocket scientist to know that shit. You know what I'm saying? But like, fuck that shit. Don't you get tired of seeing your homies? In caskets, you know what I'm saying? Once you're going, you ain't not coming back. Like I told you, that's a hundred. You can fight a motherfucker every time you see that nigga, and you're gonna win eventually, you know what I'm saying? Put them hands up, like, and even us being the elders nowadays, you know what I'm saying? It's up to us to make a difference type shit. If not, I mean, let the youngest do what they gonna do, but shit, if you got something to do with it, what you gonna do about it? Your kids gonna be grown. I'm 26 now, my daughter, she's nine years old, man. She gonna be in middle school and high school before I know it type shit. And this ain't the shit I want her having to go to school worrying about and having to be in these predicaments fucking with all this bullshit that's going on. Like, the shit ain't gonna get better on its own, you know what I'm saying? It's up to us to try to make some type of change. How the fuck can anybody say they so fucking real, uh, they holding down they hood, but they don't really give a fuck about our communities type shit and the shit that's going on in it. Like, I don't know about y'all, but... I done been through all this shit, you know what I'm saying? I done been on both sides of the motherfucking trigger. I done been through all that shit. Jail time, ain't nothing nobody can tell me. You can ask anybody you know about me type shit. And on some real shit, 75, 80% of that shit was not worth it. You know what I'm saying? If not more. And that's just keeping it real type shit. I was blinded, man. Probably like a lot of y'all shit. I was living a fast life. You can check my background shit I've been locked up for. I was hitting licks, trying to get money. Out here trying to fuck with these bitches and... I don't know, man. Riding for niggas who wouldn't even walk for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, them niggas, you think that's your homies? A lot of them niggas is not your motherfucking homies, man. Niggas is gonna get what they can get out you type shit. And it is what it is type shit. Like, niggas will rat on you so quick. Ask anybody you know, man. Everybody's a snitch in every click type shit. Motherfuckers can't do the time. The same shit they telling y'all, preaching to y'all how you gonna ride for the block. It's the same shit that they not gonna do, man. Motherfuckers don't know nothing about loyalty niggas type be. shit. You know what I'm saying? They repping this neighborhood, going so hard for they click. You know what I'm saying? Putting in work, they quick to shoot. But as soon as they go down, they tell them. You know what I'm saying? So then, all the work you done put into, you done put yourself in a fucked up predicament. Like, you ready to lay down this motherfucking 30, 40 years? You know what I'm saying? You get a murder, you ready to do this life? Type shit, and a lot of people can't hold their weight. So then, they turn around, they snitching on their homies. Then, they can't even go back to the same neighborhood that they got put in the predicament for. Like... You know what I'm saying? Niggas is lost in that cycle, man. Like, I don't know. Like, I ain't gonna preach to you. You know what I'm saying? I ain't nobody preaching. I'm just putting you on game, letting you know what's a, what's a thousand. You know what I'm saying? You can either take it for what it is or you can just keep doing it how you doing it. 